Israeli warheads hammered a research facility near Damascus twice this weekend, killing dozens of Syrian soldiers, while more than 100 are missing. At the UN on Monday, Secretary General Ban Ki-moon's office responded with concern. The Secretary General expressed a grave concern about reports of airstrikes in Syria by the Israeli Air Force. The Secretary General called on all sides uh, to exercise maximum calm and restraint and to act with a sense of responsibility to prevent an escalation of what is already a devastating and highly dangerous conflict. The Secretary General urged respect for national sovereignty and territorial integrity of all countries in the region and adherence to all relevant uh, Security Council resolutions. Israel has neither confirmed or denied the attacks and the UN statement of concern does not serve as a condemnation. Nasirki said the UN was not in a position to verify the attacks, but dozens of reports quote numerous Israeli officials explaining the hits. Syrian officials have referred to the airstrikes as acts of war in a letter from the Syrian government to the UN Security Council. Council calls for the body to shoulder its responsibilities and stop Israeli aggression. Now, in other news, an independent UN investigator said on Monday that victims and witnesses are telling her that chemical weapons have been used in Syria by the foreign-backed opposition. What appear on um, um, to our investigation that uh, that was uh, used by the opponents, by the rebels, and we have no no indication at all that the government, Syria, uh, the authority of the Syria government have used chemical weapons. Secretary General Ban's office reacted to that as well, issuing a statement that backtracked a bit from Del Ponte's statement. They issued a press release today clarifying that it has not reached conclusive findings about the use of chemical weapons in Syria by any parties uh, to the conflict. And as a result, the commission said it's not in a position to comment further on the allegations at this time. The Cirque went on to say that Del Ponte's inquiry answers to the UN Human Rights Council and is in no way connected to the technical investigation team appointed by the Secretary General, which is still trying to gain access to Syria. Whether the two investigations can or ever will share information, however, is not known. Hank Flynn, Press TV, New York.